I, I know nothing about, I know you guys uh, killed Dr. Martin Luther King, <laughs> so I, I assume it was you guys in this room. That's how, that's how history works. No, so thank you for the three-day weekend. <laughs> so, <laughs> been an interesting trip. I've been traveling around for the last couple of weeks, uh, visiting other cities, doing comedy, um, finding people's jokes that I like, and then performing them in other cities where I know another city. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, it's been an interesting trip. I, uh, I was in uh, Texas for a few nights, doing shows out there. Uh, the Lone Star State is what they call Texas. I'm assuming that is out of five. <laughs> you know who doesn't like jokes about Texas? <laughs> Fucking Texans. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Holy shit. You think the country, the state that gave us George W. Bush and tried to give us Rick Perry would have a little bit more <laughs> sense of humor about themselves? You'd be wrong. You'd be wrong. Uh, I don't know if you guys know this, a few years ago, the Republican Party of Texas uh, became the first political group in the history of the known universe. Uh, to take a public stand against critical thinking. <laughs> that is not a thing I made up. That was a real thing that was in their platform in like 2012. And then to prove how serious they were, they revealed the rest of their platform. <laughs> <laughs> Texas is the state that changed its history books because they were upset that American history was not Christian enough because it has people like Thomas Jefferson and Thomas Paine in it. <laughs> they, like, I know a lot of great people in Texas, and as long as none of them are allowed to write textbooks and run for office, <laughs> we're going to be fine. <laughs>